Welcome back guys. As you can see the team of the year start as a tradable now. And they are so damn cheap. You can see a 90 overall Al was going for two and a half million. That is so so cheap. Because earlier an anti overall was going for like say five million. Even at a left wing position that we all all of us have, still uh, Cristiano Ronaldo was going at uh, more than five million. Let's see how much Harry Kane and all going. Okay, you can see how uh, Kante is going for 3.7. He's sort of the best uh, central midfielders in the game. He's going for 3.7. Harry Kane is going for 4.1. The market's crazy, guys. The market's completely broken at the moment. Let's see what uh, Lewandowski would go for. Okay, I'll see what. He was around uh, 3 million earlier. Now he's going for 1.7, 1.5. I see. Okay, at the moment there is nothing below 1.5 but I've seen some uh, up to 1 million some of these coins so the market's completely broken if you want to buy something uh, this may be the time to buy but selling now would be a bad idea because these players were going uh, for a lot more earlier and now the prices have just fallen completely See, I saw Alves going for around 6 million. Kante is also about uh, 6 to 7 million uh, when they started, when they became auctionable, and now it is completely just everything is gone. Okay, so let us go. I'm going to claim my points, uh, the rewards I could get, and I'm going to get the pass as well. Of course, I'll have to pay one dollar real cash, one euro, I think. Because being a YouTuber, there are people who subscribe me who would uh, like to see this as well. So, being a YouTuber, I need to do these things uh, to show what they get if they give the if they pay the one dollar. What would they get? Uh, how good these players are all. So I would like to show those things for, for that purpose. I would get that as well. Okay, let's start guys. Uh, to start with itself, I uh, have to say that the league tournaments, uh, they matter a lot. We, was, we won one and I got six points for that. That is uh, really amazing. We only get four points for playing one time and one league tournament victory could give you six points, which is a lot. Okay, so start with uh, 20 skill boost. So we can move on to the next one. Uh, 75,000 coins. The end of an era, it, it looks really nice actually. The logo looks really nice. I'm going to make this uh, end of era logo as my team's logo. I have a real job and I work for around uh, 10 hours a day. So I have less time to grind in the game these days. So buying uh, small offers, I cannot afford the really big offers as well. Like uh, 15,000, 10,000. Uh, those kind of offers I cannot afford. So I buy these uh, small offers on the side to help my channel progress. 
it is needed uh, as a youtuber and there you go uh, 500 fifa points okay i have reached 1990 i need 10 more i think so i know how to get the 10 more from the daily activities yes okay there's a two there another two here okay six here that that would be that would give me 10 uh fifa points i have never missed uh, daily activities even once when i don't have time i would play the one okay uh, level the password nice I would play the one that uh, the first campaigns, uh, first match, which is uh, scoring three penalties, uh, which is kind of easy and doesn't take too much time. These days, mostly I play that only uh, because campaign matches take some time and I lack time a little bit these days. exactly 2000 FIFA points so I think now I can go and uh, buy the end of era pass okay we start with an end of era player Nice, a uh, nice French player. Okay, he has a new skill boost uh, which I haven't got yet. Now, uh, let's go and get that end of era pass which would let us claim the offers on the top. Okay, this looks kind of beautiful. Can end of era pass. N6 end of era points, which should also help. So, which means in the free to play rewards, which is the rewards on the below row, and the pay to play rewards on the top row. So, in the free to play rewards, the bottom row, I need a couple more points and I could get uh, the player of the month token for January. That's really nice. Uh, I just need two more, which I would get. I would get four now uh, by playing these. Okay, so let's go and claim the end of era logo to start with. So I'm going to change my logo since I got a new one. Okay, I got uh, some of these logos. There you go, the end of our logo. And you can see the logo next to my name as uh, became the end of era logo. End of an era. I believe I would claim another player. Okay, that's a uh, 50,000 training XP. Once you reach a higher level, you need uh, millions of training XP for every level. So these uh, small amounts of XP won't matter much there, but uh, before you hit 90, uh, there's the help. A hundred skill boost. In the top row, I'm actually interested in uh, the coins I could possibly get. I could possibly get millions of coins, uh, which is uh, needed for me at the moment for the for training some of my players, especially the icons. 
uh, since icons have their own campaigns and we get experience points from there uh coins is what i lack at the moment if i could get uh enough coins out of this i could get a uh, maldini and yashin to uh 105 overall and uh those who have been following me for some time i remember that i've already been pursuing since december actually uh, i said that without spending any fifa points i would get the player of the month for January um, on course for that I already had uh, two player of the month tokens I can pick up one more uh, this week and uh, the one I get from this uh, this event would be a bonus uh, for a 2.5 million coins I would get that uh, player of the month without using this token uh, so that everyone can see that it is possible for the Uh, free to play players to get the player of the month i am not completely free to play of course i'm showing you guys buying um, of i'm buying stuff but i did not buy uh, any i did not spend any fifa points or any i did not buy any packs uh, for the team of the week event whatever was available there i got uh, only through grinding i saved points from december um, until january if we save for two months then we can easily get the player of the month start saving one month the next month we could get the player of the month okay so uh, second elite sweden uh, that's actually kind of nice because sweden has an icon coming up in larsson so He's going to be helpful for me. I'm not going to use him. I don't need a 85 or all center midfielder, especially not with a new boost that I have to take all the way up. So these players are not that useful to me. I cannot get a Ronaldinho. That's that's way out of my uh, league. Don't have that much money. Um, so none of the other players interest. Even Ronaldinho, I don't really need because we can easily get Dele Ali to 100. Any uh, any player small p2p or uh, completely free to play player anybody can train dele ali to 100 so i don't think we need another uh, kaka is also you can see thomas rosicky and the central attack midfielder kaka is central attack midfielder ronaldinho is also a central attack midfielder so we don't don't need any of these players of course i won't get ronaldinho but i need these coins uh, that's all i care about at the moment and i want to get this uh, end of era kit it looks kind of nice i'm pretty sure uh, i will get that as well i'm sure most of us uh, who are in legendary at least would uh, end up getting to level 20 again the six points uh, we would get from say the winning league tournaments matter a lot So guys make sure you guys have active leagues even if you don't remember uh, in the first league match I did not participate in the league match I still ended up getting the say the 6 points I was benched for the league tournament still I got the 6 points so guys even if you don't if you are not selected for the league tournament you would still get it as long as you are in the winning team so select uh, the guys who are good at it or everyone would get the points okay so another couple of points would give me 250 training uh, skill boost okay so i will be back uh, i'll be back with uh, showing you guys getting the player of the month point and uh, the team of the week for this week's uh, i'll review the team of the week as well okay guys then thanks for watching thanks for the support guys bye bye see you guys later